Hey everyone, my name's Pupsker, and guess what? Yes, Atlas Prime just came out. Hallelujah! So let's go over where to farm him and Atlas as well, because, you know, why not? Uh, along with Atlas Prime, guess what also came out? Yeah, it was a uh, Death Cube Prime, and I think the Teko Prime, his cool little punchy gloves, because these things are awesome. If you didn't know, Atlas is... Uh, through and through a brawler. He punches, paralyzes, freezes, spawns golems, and essentially just spawns a shield and pushes it forward. He also gains HP off kills and ground drops, so he's pretty hype. Let's go over where to actually farm him though. Of course, if you always go to your void relics over here, you can search Atlas Prime. And I actually already have one. I have a Meso E3. So here you can see he is farmed in Meso E3, Axie A6, Lith D1, and Neo A3. Hallelujah, we know where he is. So, in Neo A3, he looks to be a uncommon drop, and that is the Atlas Prime Systems. So the Atlas Prime Systems drops off Neo A3. That can be found in these various locations across the star map. Yeah, most of the Void, Pluto, Eris, a lot of Sedna, and Saturn, Void, Uranus, uh, Jupiter, Europa. Yeah, that's pretty much where to get those. So that is the Atlas Prime Systems Blueprint. Now, this is the Atlas Prime Blueprint. It is a common drop, and it drops off Lith D1. As we can see, it drops in a wide variety of locations. They all do. This one primarily uh, looks like the Void again. Earth has a good amount, Mars has a good amount, and Venus. But of course, generally you should just take a screenshot of this or look at these when you want to go farm them. Try to pick maybe defenses, uh, or if you want to go really fast and don't want to farm items either, you can just go rescues. Rescues are always fast. Or captures. Captures are also really fast. Now, the Axie A6 Relic has the Atlas Prime Neuroptics Blueprint. Ooh, and that's the rare drop, no shock there. Axie, always fun like that. So that'll take quite some time to farm. As you can see, it drops on a lot less locations than the other ones, like primarily a ton lot, or a ton less, because of course it's an Axie. But it primarily drops on Pluto, Eris, and Sedna, uh, also the Void, and Uranus and Neptune. Yeah, it has a lot of locations still, but not as many as the other ones. Now, finally, Meso E3. That is where the Atlas Prime chassis blueprint drops, and that looks to be an uncommon drop. Now, it drops freaking everywhere as well. Saturn, Venus, Mars, Neptune, uh, Void is a high location, Jupiter a lot, Ceres a good amount, and Europa a good amount. Yeah, like, obviously these drop in a lot of locations, and as I have not been farming Prime, or Relics lately, look how many Relics I have in my vault. I can only imagine how veteran players of 5 to 10 years plus have uh, such high amounts, but yeah, I'm starting to finally build up my farm. And now I can start farming Warframes. Finally, where to get Atlas, he's very simple because he is a quest to drop. That is right, if you're new to the game, you probably don't have him, or if you're lazy and haven't done all the quests like me, but he drops from the Jordis Precept. This is the quest essentially to get Atlas. Yeah, I know, pretty simple, right? Uh, currently, I have to craft potent Feralic pods in the foundry. You want to see what that looks like? Because it's really fun stuff. Um... It's currently seven hours waiting. So yeah, uh, I haven't been making it a prime priority of mine to actually farm Warframes. I've been making it priority to just do other things. Primarily Nightwave. Currently, I am only rank 13 on Nightwave. That's the end of the video, guys. Remember, you can always search for Prime Parts in the Void Relic segment over here in your ship and as long as you have the map tile unlocked it'll show you where you can farm it since none of these are vaulted it shows me everywhere see since i have everything unlocked use this it's a pretty good tool and as always i'll keep making this video these videos uh, sorry 
If you like the videos, guys, though, make sure to subscribe. I like making these where to farm guides and probably eventually we'll do other stuff because who knows? Uh, check out my Twitter where I shit post and complain about very meaningless things and talk about YouTube and interesting things that I find about YouTube. I shit post about YouTube a lot. Also, New Nerd City video was hype as hell and it's all about YouTube. So, yeah, um,. Check out my Twitch, I very rarely stream, I'm making YouTube more of a priority right now, so I'll probably start posting videos a little bit more often, as of, as of soon, pretty much. And I'm going to try to stream a lot this week, because again, I need to get a lot of Nightwave done. So yeah, this is essentially just the end of the video where I plug everything. And I really want to go over Nightwave and streaming, because, god, I'm only level 13, 20,000 Kuba, nice, and I have so many more to do. So, tune in so I don't hopefully go crazy. Thank you guys, and I'll see you next time. Peace.